uh, my camera stopped suddenly due to a low battery. But this is the paper capacitor. It's the, the second test about uh, how um, capacitor sound, audio capacitor sound. I now use them as a coupling capacitor. And for me it's still a question. Do all these different types of capacitors sound different? There's a lot of information on all, all kinds of forums. But uh, I wanted to do this test to see whether this is real. This is still the paper tar capacitor, 10 nanofarad. And now we go to the oil capacitor. Finally, this is the oil capacitor, also from 10 nanofarad. This is the waveform again. It's a um, differentiated square wave. Okay, now I want to switch to the triangle uh, wave. And here we see that due to the effect of the capacitors, the triangle wave is changed into this waveform. It's more or less a sine wave. It's not a complete sine wave, so there are some harmonics. And this is the effect from the triangle uh, wave oscillator on an oil capacitor from uh, 10 nanofarad, or in other words, 0 0.01 microfarad. I switch to the paper to the paper tar capacitor now. This is the paper tar capacitor. This is the waveform. Still paper tar. Switch to the silvered mica capacitor. This is the waveform with the silvered mica capacitor. Still a silvered mica capacitor. Switch to the high voltage foil capacitor. It looks as if there are less, the highest harmonic isn't present, so I switch back to the silver mica capacitor to see whether there's difference. So now also the highest harmonic isn't visible with the silver mica capacitor. So I switch to the foil capacitor now. It's the mylar. The aluminium looking capacitor, this one. This is the mylar capacitor. And I switch to the uh, blue ceramic multi layer capacitor, often used in computer power supplies. It has very good uh, properties to damp uh, very short high voltage peaks. That is one of the properties from the blue multi-layer capacitor. It can damp peaks. I, I don't see any difference between the other ones. And finally, this very small ceramic capacitor. So, these are the results of my measurements with the frequency analyzer. I hope um, it can keep the discussion going. And I wish you luck.